my friend and I'm like, Chelsea, because her name's Chelsea too, Chelsea, do we want to ride four rides or a lot? And she's all, Chelsea, I want to ride a lot. So I say, can you just give me the $20 unlimited ride pass? He's like, yeah, I can do that. So I look at my wallet. All I have is a 20. And I'm like, yeah, I didn't plan on buying any funnel cake or anything or fried Oreos or chicken on a stick. Ooh. So I'm like, yeah, let's just let's just buy this unlimited thing. So he puts a little purple strap on me and this stamp that says void some, somehow, I guess, you know, void. And we go and ride all the rides, obviously. Well, well, Elena and Kelsey decide they're going to get in the ice cream truck because there's this new attraction for the three-year-olds. The three-year-olds. And it's an ice cream truck that just goes up in the air and down. Simple. And I'm thinking I would give money to see this thing just go, and just start going to town instead of sing this cute precious little song and they're up there just texting mm. okay so I had to give the brakes a ride I mean no rides a break sorry I did that often I had to give the rides a break because I was getting a headache bless my little heart I was getting a headache and my stomach started hurting so we go and ride the teacups yeah and <laughs> I wish I had this picture all five of us are in this little blue teacup just Facebook status update. Chelsea is sitting in a teacup. So, we go up in this little rocket ship ride. And all this, we're looking down, just chilling, scoping out the people there, you know. Only, only teenagers making out. And you know, that's all. You know? I mean, there's only children walking around. They're just trying to lick each other's mouth out or something. I mean, it's the normal, I guess. But anyway, what I was trying to get to. This carnival comes to town during spring break, which here in Alabama, it's supposed to be warm. But no, it's cold. It's cold and rainy. So, I, you know, my eyes are like getting blown out of the socket and my mouth is like this and we're up in the rides because the wind's blowing and it's cold. I'm surprised I don't have pneumonia. All I got is a little stuffy nose, you know. But they come to town and tell you for $20, you can ride all the rides you want to, which is a huge array of like 10. And, and, and they last like two minutes, okay? And they're the type of rides, you know, that are assembled in like an hour and you, you're going around in circles and you hear the little, wee, 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 you know, you hear all the little screws come down and I'm like, I hope they really approve this ride. So, and then you have the people, you know, working the little stands with all the little animals things and they're like, you want to race? Don't you, little girl? And I'm like, no, no, um, I don't want to race or play a game. No. Yes, you do. For three dollars, you can try to win a prize. Well, this entices my little brother Kyle. He's ten and brought his little friend Luke, who is nine. And they're like, "Oh my gosh, I have to race and win that stuffed animal." And I'm like, "Kyle, we can go to Dollar Tree and buy one for a dollar, but you're about to blow nine dollars and try to buy, find this thing." Well, all they had to do was squirt water in a little hole this big. And whoever got their little boat down the first won. Well, Kyle wins this. How is this fun? Or, I mean, really? I mean, listen. You can't. You can't even like tell it your problems or anything. I mean, th th this horn gets in the way. You can't hug it or anything. You can't sleep with it at night. Would you want to take it to a slumber party? I mean, that's not even cotton. That's like styrofoam. They grab like recycled styrofoam cups in here or something. You hear that? They, he spent like $10 on this thing. It, ridiculous. So, then my sister 
Oh, she's all into stuffed animals. So she gets into this thing of like throwing pins or something at some kind of balloon and wins this. What what is this? Okay, don't don't tell me, oh Chelsea, that's a baby Ruth plush something. Like what what does this represent? Like oh, you know, can you go this with it? Is it I this what it is. It's just kinda of one of those things like you're in the car ride and you're or something or like maybe a neck something. I don't I don't know. But I mean, they make you pay twenty dollars at the door. And then like a funnel cake or chicken on a stick or God forbid something else deep fried, you know, maybe like strawberries on a stick fried or something. It's like ten dollars. And they want you to blow all this money and then all you get is this. Sad little hopes of little girls trying to win rabbits or goldfish and you're making them spend their whole allowance. We in a recession. Sorry, I don't know. So, um, that's all I really wanted to say, and, um, I think my job here is done, so, peace, love, and rockets.